Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how to link XML file and CSS file in PHP. So for this, first we need to write CSS file and after that XML file also. But see, first we'll see here XML file. Here first we need to write the prolog XML version encoding and this. This part is a optional part that we, need, we can write the XML and the tag. After that here XML here style sheet we are including the style sheet in XML document type equal to text oblique CSS and here we are providing the link as items.css. Here I created one file XML file items.xml and the CSS file items.css. Here we are writing program for XML and product is the root inside this product and inside this we are considering item as a child. Here you can write the item category equal to suppose here is a stationary item, grocery item, other items you can write the items category equal to stationary or grocery and inside this you can write the different attributes as name, name as a pain, price 200 and quantity 10. See this is very important name, price and quantity. We are starting this and you need to give the end tag also. Maintain the hierarchy. See this root is started here and then child is started here and different attributes is at the same level. In XML you need to maintain the index. Here is the item, here is the end of item. Again we are starting with the second item, item, name, pencil, price and quantity. You can add n number of items like this. You can just copy paste and you can change this value. Now I want to give the different formatting for name, price, quantity. So here you can write the CSS file for the same. See here the CSS file for this name. See here we are using the name, price, quantity. This name, price and quantity. So here we are using the name, color for this name, blue, font family, font size, font bold. And here for the price also again we are using the same. Here you can change the font size. Suppose I want to give the font size 10 or 20. Font color is yellow. Suppose you want to change the font family as a times new Roman or any other effect. You can give the name here. You can give the size here in the points and the font also. Then how to execute this one? So to execute this code first we will open the one browser. And here we will run this code. Suppose here write the local host. I am using here camp server. So local host slash and after that your folder name. My folder name is Sonali PHP. And just you can press the enter so you can see the here the different file. I have written this program inside this temp2 folder. And here is my program items.xml. Just you can click on this and you can run or you can write here, you can click here and you can change the name of the file. See, this pen 210 and pen. See, this is your CSS file. You can observe this color yellow. Yellow color we applied for the price. Okay. And for the value there is no any color. Okay. No any color for the value. So, you can check the name. The third one is quantity QTY and if you want to use the same here see for the quantity color is the black but if you want to change select this one copy this one and here you can paste it and here we copied the all the text this uh, CSS style uh, price to quantity so here is the quantity now color is the red then font family Arial font size is 10 here you can change the font size also. Font size is a 20. Font is bold. And save this file. Okay. Go to the file. Save this file. And first we will run this file. Items.css. Just click on this. 
click on the reload so this text will come automatically here after that will click on a items.xml and will check for the same okay just click here and refresh it so here you will get the output see now this is the sun in a red color and this one see if you are trying to change here uh, in this file you are uh, changing so if you want this effect on this output screen you need to execute both okay suppose i want to change the here font size or uh, here color just click here change this color to the pink color is pink and after that see click on a file click on a save then go back here go on this file item dot css see here is the pink color now so again go back and here run the xml file so see you can observe the effect